Introducing the Dresser Rand Smart Case System. Case stands for Compressed Air Energy Storage, a process in which electrical energy is captured in the form of compressed air, then converted back into electricity during peak demand. The Smart Case system is well suited for renewable applications such as wind turbines, where power production fluctuates greatly. Here's how it works. Excess capacity during off-peak hours is used to drive a series of air compressors. In this three-phase design, the air is cooled between each compressor. The compressed air is then pumped into a massive cavern, large enough to house the Empire State Building. The process of filling the cavern is called compression mode. At full charge, the cavern air pressure can reach up to 2,800 pounds per square inch. When consumer demand is high, the plant then goes into generation mode. The compressed air is released from the cavern into a heat exchanger called a recuperator, where it's heated to 600 degrees Fahrenheit. Next, the hot air is expanded in a very high-pressure turbine before entering the high-pressure turbine, where natural gas-fired combustors heat the air to approximately 1,000 degrees Fahrenheit. The air from the high-pressure turbine is then reheated to 1,600 degrees in the low-pressure turbine. This process rapidly changes the volume and velocity of the air, producing energy that drives an electrical generator. Altogether, the single Smart Case train can produce up to 160 megawatts of electrical power. The discharged air travels through the recuperator before being released back into the atmosphere at a temperature of around 180 degrees. This process is very efficient, as 90% of the heat is recovered and turned into electricity. During intermediate hours when consumer demand is moderate, the Dresser Rand Smart Case can produce electricity while simultaneously diverting some compressed air aside for storage. At full capacity, the Dresser Rand Smart Case plant, consisting of eight trains, is capable of generating 1,280 megawatts. That's enough to power 600,000 homes for an entire day.